sense actually second home sense trip i went two days in a row i've been getting a lot of organizing done so i wanted to get organizers and um, i actually wanted to get a different because see how the golds don't match i wanted to get a different organizer for this tray so and also everything is kind of that that same gold except for this one this is like that brassy gold so i did get a new organizer for all my uh, stationary stuff and stuff but um, I did also pick up new pens and then this just arrived so funny thing you guys I think I'm gonna have two day planners because I bought this one which I still really like I was using it yesterday and then I found one today I liked even more but I think I can separate it anyways uh, with just like my business and then also YouTube and just like starting to schedule things a little bit better so I got that and then Right behind that, I actually got two sets of file folders from Amazon, so make things happen. It has like three different colors in here. There's gray. Oh, it shows you the tree there. So it's got gray, pink, and white. Work for it and hustle. So I'll link these down below. They're really, really nice. And I have all my pictures out right now, actually. Oh, sorry. Still hand. I had coffee. Uh, but I have all my pictures out right here. And... I put up my pictures that I bought. So I got these. I was going to show you in the haul that I'm about to do, the Home Sense haul, but I wanted to get them up and I was so excited. I shared them on Instagram. So let me zoom in here. And okay, so I went back today to try to get two more because I wanted to put one more set above and one more set below, but they were all out. So I'm going to have to keep going back to Home Sense as they always get like new stock in. Uh, but that one right there, that's actually from like when I hit my milestone with my brand. So it's very meaningful, that photo right here. This is my very first launch party. So that's when I launched my brand and I have my family, um, my mom, my brother, Brianna, which is his wife, and then my cousins and Rye next to my mom. So right here we have our wedding. I love that photo. Down here we have when the girls were born, munchkins. Right here we have a family photo with Maxie at our old house and when we were expecting the girls. So I think I chose really nice photos. They all are meaningful to me, milestones. So uh, we still have our wreath on the door right there as well. So I think we're gonna leave the Christmas lights up for a little bit longer and then um, Ryan will probably take them down. I've got my beanie on today, but I'm gonna go into, everything is so organized in here. I'm so happy with it. Also this little tray I added from Amazon. I think it's Kate Spade. And yeah, it's just very organized. So I am definitely going to show you my home set stuff. I have it all in the kitchen right now. Okay, so the light is very bright in here right now. It's very sunny, but I was working on the rest of the Christmas tree this morning. I have to grab Ryan's ladder and do the very top, but you can see I'm like almost done. And these were the new storage bins that I got from uh, Canadian Tire, which are awesome. I really like them. They come on rollers too. And you can just see everything. So I have those. I have a ton downstairs and this is it. This is all I have left. and. We have all the Christmas stuff down. So just got back from HomeSense. As you can see, I've got three big bags here. Big, big bags. Okay, I'm gonna grab. First bag I have right here. And yes, I am in my beanie in my cozy coffee sweater right now. It's the weekend, it's all right. HomeSense haul. So this is the first time I went to HomeSense this year. So I went yesterday and then today too, because yesterday I got organizers, picture frames, just little things. And then I realized as I was working on the pantry last night that we were missing a lot of other containers. So that's what I went there for today and ended up getting a lot of containers and just like storage. But wanted to show you the other stuff I got. Uh, first thing here for butter to go inside our fridge. Oh, come on, focus. There we go. So I got this, love this. And it's gray, if you wanted to see what it, Looks like there, it is gray to go with the kitchen. Um, I got these pens for my office, which I thought would be really nice. They only came in two sets of colors, but these were more my colors. Got these for uh, our chairs and couches, just in case we needed some extra ones. And these are for you know who, I don't wanna say the word. We needed a big strainer for pasta, so I ended up getting this one, which is pretty nice. And Brookstone, $12.99. There. Now, these are exciting. I'm really excited for these. So I got lots of new storage containers. These are for fridge and pantry. These came in a set for $10, which these are gonna be fantastic. And then also, I got these. So vegetable keeper, you can put vegetables in here and they last longer. And they also have this little, or the gritty part at the bottom too. So it's gonna be easy to clean, but that's what it looks like there. 
I got two of them. So these were $19.99. I love when they do this. So like I usually buy like a big basket, which we needed anyways for the girls. So they put a ton of stuff in there. Just helps carrying everything. Uh, I got new towelettes. These are just really nice and plain, but they go with our kitchen, just white and gray. I got a table runner. Now I was like 50-50 on this, but it was $13 on sale. So I was like, why not? Is that focusing? There we go. Um, but I will put it on the table after and show you guys what it looks like. But it's like, can you see like gray and white? And it, the gray has like sparkle to it. So I just thought that would be nice. I got this for Max. How cute is this? So rough day, Chardonnay. A little toy, $7.99. And okay, so this is the day planner I got. This one right here. Uh, this is just so cute. Look at the inside here. I really liked it. I don't know if you've heard of this company before. Uh, let me find fun pages. Yeah, see everything's like super fashion-y. I feel like this is great for YouTube and like planning out what videos I'm going to do and stuff like that, but it's called the Plan Happy Life, so they're probably on Instagram, but like look at that. So detailed. I just thought this would be so nice, and I got this on sale. It was $13, so I was happy about that. And I got more of these yesterday, so they're four juice boxes, but I realized I needed another one, so I got another one. And these are, can't find a price, $4.99. Let's put it over. Now these are awesome. I got two of them, they're the spinners, and I love these. Uh, so these are for fridge and pantry, but you can use them like for whatever you want. You can even use these for skincare if you really wanted to, but I'm gonna put these in the pantry. And I got two, so these were $12.99 can't fit. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> uh, got those. Now, this is the one I got in replace of the one I had in my, um, in my office already. So that gold was just too brassy for me. So I got this light gold one and it's mirrored on the bottom. So I thought that'd be really nice. And this was $14.99. I'm running out of room here, you guys. And then this one fridge and pantry stacking bin. So I feel like if we're really organized in our fridge and pantry, like it'll just get us to eat better and just be more organized, which is a goal of mine for 2021. So, um, yeah, so I got that. Can't find the price on it. Oh, seven or er, $7.99. And then this basket is obviously for the girls and it says love on this side. It was $29.99. Last bag here. And the girls are eating with rye right now, so you might hear them a little bit in the background. Uh, these I got for food. Um, we do a lot of leftovers, so I actually needed more containers. This is $5.99. You can see here, it has like a nice like plasticky um, lid, which I like. So yeah, these just stood out to me. I think they're nice. They're stackable too, which I really like. So in the fridge, you can stack them. Um, here we go. Got those. Now I got these. So these are really great because we've been buying eggs from uh, Costco and it comes in a massive thing. And I just think these look so much better and they uh, are also stackable. So you can go like that and stir your eggs and how nice does that look? That looks a lot nicer. So these were $12.99 and there's even like a little fridge picture. I'm gonna show you what that looks like. I feel like that looks so clean and organized in there. So happy I found these. I saw another lady actually that was gonna grab them and they were the only ones left. I'm like, no, I need my eggs to look nice. And we do eggs a lot, so happy I got those. Lastly, this is for the princesses. Now, this is for shoes. Little shoe container, it comes with a lid. Oh, I got more stuff actually. Okay, so last few things here. This is the storage bin for their shoes. And then this, how freaking cute is this? So we don't have rose gold in our kitchen, but I was like, these, I can take them out and just use these and I don't know, gift this to someone, but I loved the cuteness on these little spices. So we have parsley, cinnamon powder, basil, salt, and rosemary, oregano. You can find like the cutest thing at Home Sense and Home Goods. So cute. And I think this was 20, yeah, 20 bucks. And then, um, Right here, microfiber cloths, which I wanted to get ones because right now we have like orange and blue and like the worst colors like for our kitchen. So I got gray, white, and the top ones aren't really my favorite, but I like the plain solid gray and white. So that's everything. Let me show you what that looks like now in our kitchen. Second haul from HomeSense. So yesterday 
I will briefly show you everything that I got. Everything is sort of already in the pantry and put away, but I'll just go throughout the house today and show you what I'm doing. Basically, I wanted to finish off the pantry just to show it to you guys and get it organized in there. And then everything else kind of were things that I needed um, that I figured out yesterday that we needed. So yeah, I feel like it was a really successful home sense haul. Forgot to show these, so uh, this was the last thing I got here, placemats. So these ones are just, it comes in a set of 10, which I liked how many it came with. So these are gonna be for the kitchen and uh, these were 19.99 KJ Designs. And I bought these, but in, or they're right here, the Christmas holiday ones, don't mind my lashes. <laughs> Just right there but uh, these were the holiday set ones so this is the same brand and I went with silver and I just think this will be really nice in our kitchen sorry it's so bright by the way the Sun is just shining okay so a few things from Amazon just arrived wanted to quickly show you hi boo yeah yeah no you're Sophia uh, okay so I wanted to get some more organizers for their dirty laundry and also just for some toys so I got this big one here I'll link it down below and also look at Max you are silly. Any of your dogs do this? He's obsessed with my fur in my office. Hold on, honey. And uh, this, Whoa. yes, honey, he's being funny, isn't he? Okay, and this one here is for me and Sophia. Do you wanna see your bag? Look, look, you can put stuff in it. So I got two of these, that's how it comes. It comes with an insert in the middle here, and then you can put like whatever you want, like socks and uh, little things. You can even put like hair bands, bows, whatever. Um, in here, sorry, I'm talking really quickly. I only have a minute and I, I'm starving, I have to make lunch. And a few things I got from my office here, I got gold and acrylic scissors, which I've been wanting, so these ones here. I got this beautiful little day planner. Well, it's kind of, yeah, it's I guess like a monthly planner that you can have on your desk. So I wanted to get one of these and I've actually never had one, which I'm surprised, but yeah, I have that. And then, okay, so this thing, I'm gonna show you what this is. This is actually really, really cool. This goes on my desk, so I got light pink. Okay, so Mia's sitting at my desk right now. It's a little hard to show you guys, but this right here underneath can actually, you can have your uh, your computer screen, like your desktop on top of it as well. Um, so I might try to push it forward after and, um, yeah, but I don't, I don't know, it's not really going with this pink, so, uh, but it is really nice, I do like it. I liked the pictures when I saw it and I like how big it is. Um, but I think I might just have to find a different spot for this then, but that's okay. And then I would put this just like all this stuff yeah. here and then use this tray for something else. And yes, mommy has to clean up these pictures, pictures, doesn't she? And these gold scissors are so nice. I'm going to link these because these are ones that you would find in like home sense. These are beautiful. I'm excited to try this platter out too. This is really nice. Looks like a little family's made it too. Danielle and Mike. Okay. bags are so heavy you guys I just got back from indigo I haven't been there like all year since I actually since we lived in Windsor I haven't been there but I got a ton of books so I wanted to do like a little book haul with you and most of them are fashion books but I thought I'd pull them out I also went to winners and dollar store so I'll show you what I have in a minute and uh yeah, my goodness. I just got off the phone with Erin. So she's my photographer for all my product shots. Um, we're working on the makeup line. I'm so excited. There's so many fun creative shots happening. So I'm really excited, but okay. A few things of what I bought. Look how pretty this book is. So I got Jillian Harris's book right here. Um, a collection of recipes for everyday and casual celebrations. And this is what it looks like. I thought this would be so nice in my office. Plus, I don't know if I've said, but I really wanna take up like baking and cooking this year. And it's one of my goals to start cooking more. So this book is beautiful. It's so nice. And it's a really nice like book to have in your office too. So I just think this will look really nice. And I always look to see what the title looks like here because that's what's showing. So really like that. And then um, I got Gather at Home. So this girl, Monica, Gibbs or Hibbs, sorry. I follow her on Instagram. She's actually from or lives in Vancouver, so I thought that was pretty neat. Uh, so yeah, her book is also very beautiful and aesthetically pleasing. So this is what it looks like on the in oops, inside here. Yeah, so I have that one there. Yeah, really, really nice. I wanted to get Jen Atkins' book, so I saw that she had one. Um, so she obviously is a big hairstylist. I follow her on Instagram. She has way hair care line. Uh, so I wanted to read her book. Let me know if you guys have read it down below. And, um, I 
got Megan Hess. I love her books so much. These are the prettiest books I have ever seen. I have two of them right now, Paris and one other one, um, but this is the elegance one that I wanted to get. So it's so gorgeous. Look at the inside, like her illustrations are just like out of this world. So beautiful. So I got that. I got one more of her books actually. Didn't see that coming. I got this book too by Rachel Hollis, Putting Life Back Together When Your World Falls Apart. I wanted to give that a read and saving the best for last. Look at this book. It was $65. I didn't know if I wanted to buy it, but I'm like, it's so beautiful. So it's called Couture Megan Hess and I follow her on Instagram. Her work is stunning and I'm sorry I look like such crap right now, my God. Yeah, but that's okay. I have not had time to get ready and um, yeah, that's all right. But look at her illustrations. They are so beautiful. Her books are just like a piece of art. And I got a table, like a little coffee table for my office just the other day on Wayfair. So once it comes in, I'll show you how I'm gonna set up. But these books I wanted to have decorated and um, have all nice. And I just thought this would be nice for my office. I also got like a little notebook right here. It's black, it has gold writing. It's just really nice and simple. I also wanted to try this, the Hello Baby line. So I got me and Sophia shampoo and baby wash. And then I got this pen, oops. Kind of cool it has like gold flecks in it and then i got them the hello baby premium baby lotion right here right now i think we're just using a vino so i thought i would try something different and then i got this binder which i didn't know was so expensive till after it was 30 dollars. but i went to the dollar store after and got paper for it but i thought a binder might be nice to organize myself and i have a lot of things i'm working on this year so i just wanted to organize in this and can you see it it's like a really nice like beige like pink color so I have that and I'm loving, oh, I need to find other frames, you guys, for, why can I not point? There we go. S to go right below, I really want to get another set of gold frames, but I cannot find them anywhere. Um, even at Winners, I tried to see if Winners had it and they had black ones, the same set as Home Sense, but just not the gold ones. And they got me and Sophia a little book right here. I stopped getting two of everything, you guys. They honestly just are learning to share things and it's crazy if you get two of everything. So I just got them this nice Valentine's Day book. I actually got Ryan his birthdays on January 21st, so it's coming up. 39 39 but i made him uh, a daddy book so once it comes in i'll show you it comes in actually i think on the 18th but um it says from me and sophia and it's like a whole book on um him and the girl so it's really cute i'm really excited to give it to him okay next and, uh, look how big this bag is like why is it so big um i found the girl some bows look how cute these are the girls i don't know if there's a trick to making them want to wear anything in their hair, but they really don't like to wear stuff in their hair, but I just thought I'll give it a shot. So $5.99 for really pretty colors. I got, ooh, I'm excited to show you guys this. So you already know Ryan and I are huge coffee drinkers, but Ryan really likes espresso, like just a shot of it. So I got us this set. I thought we could put it right by the coffee machine or even this would look cute in my office, but it, there's a missus and a mister. So I think this is also like kind of like a wedding gift, but I just thought that would be really nice and cute. So I have that. Okay, so next in this vlog, I promised myself, well, I wanted to do Home Sense haul, first home decor haul of 2021, plus the book haul and everything that I just got today. And lastly, we are going to organize my makeup vanity. This needs to happen because I just, whenever I go into my drawers, I, I'm just, it's just so disorganized. There's stuff everywhere and I'm just putting things into weird spots. So we're gonna do that together. And I bought this. So this tray right here, I love this because I thought I could display um, my makeup brushes. I can put my new makeup line in here and kind of have all my stuff that I use every day in this. So this was, I think, where's the price? Can't find the price, but I think it was around $30. So I have that. And then lastly, a gift for the girls. Oh, these are so cute. These are little Puma outfits, you guys, little track suits. Look at this. I don't even shop for myself. I've been wearing this coffee sweater for the last week, but look at this. This is so styling. 
Um, and it says Puma on the side and then their little Puma pants. But I just thought these would be cute to take them out in and not that we've been doing much, but I just got them these. And luckily they had two because whenever I shop at Winners, they never have two of something. Uh, regular $46, but, or $24.99. Haha, that's not a bad price. So got the girls those, really cute. And lastly, I love finding random stuff at the dollar store. So I got them a little fire truck here. It was four bucks. And um, we got some pens. So I got some uh, highlighters, some pens right here. Just, we also need some in our kitchen because like we have the only few pens I have are in my office. So we usually have to go in my office to get it. So I just thought it'd be nice to have some other ones. And then for my uh, binder, I have paper. So that's why went there for. They were actually almost all out of paper, so I guess there's a lot of people doing homeschool right now. And then my favorite, um, favorite mints. These are awesome. So yeah, that is my haul. That is my indigo, um, winners. You can always find the cutest things at winners and then also, uh, dollar store. That is what I did today, and I love these so much. I really want to use what wash wash this and use one today and have a little shot of espresso. Uh, but yeah, right now I have some work to do. I am so excited for this year. I think it's going to be a really good year, and I know um, obviously 2020 was just like a blur. It was it was crazy, but I feel like it's good to make the most out of things and just keep yourself busy. I think that's the main part. So I'm like trying to do as much as I can and at the same time I've been spending a lot of time with me and Sophia and Ryan and I just appreciate the family moments so so much. So yeah let me know what you guys have been up to for the first few weeks here of January. I also I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted me to do a 2021 YouTube intro and it was like 95% of you said yes it was like over a few thousand people said yes so I was like okay and then I texted Megan I'm like Megan we're doing this we're doing a 2021 trailer and uh, uh, or intro trailer and she said I'm so excited so I'm really really happy we're gonna do it next week and film in this house for the first time my trailer my YouTube trailer so can't wait I'll show a little clip here actually of what my old trailer looked like because um, it was a lot of fun and it was in my old beauty room but I want this one to be in the whole house and I want Ryan and the girls to be featured in it too like before and how cute would that be actually to have this and like have a little shot of espresso or something Anyways, my mind is going all the time. I feel like I'm most active in the morning and like early afternoon and, and then like by three, I'm just like, <laughs> um, but yeah. Also, I've been watching that new show uh, on Netflix that I've been showing on my Instagram a lot and a lot of you guys are watching it too. I think it's called like Bridgerton or Bridgerton. Hold on. Um, you guys probably know what I'm talking about, but uh, yeah, Bridgerton. Wow, it's rated number one right now, actually. So that's it right there. I'm still on, I think, episode two or episode one, actually. Uh, or no, sorry, episode three. I'm on episode three. Um, but it was really, really good and I like it so far and everyone is raving about it. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. Um, but other than that, my brother was sending me a bunch of series to watch on like HBO and Apple and stuff. But I've been trying to watch series because I'm like, honestly, movies are not long enough. And I feel like whenever I'm, I have my downtime, I'm watching shows and I get really hooked on shows. So, uh, yeah, anyways, I am going to clean all this up now and, uh, we'll be organizing my makeup vanity in a little bit. Good morning, you guys. So it is 9.30 right now. I just made myself a coffee. I helped Ryan with the girls. They just had breakfast. Uh, I just thought this would be suiting towards what today's video is and just what I'm doing right now. So um, I have my little vanity mug right here. This is from Hot Glam. And I really needed a coffee this morning. I'm a little tired. We did a nice sauna last night, Ryan and I. And then also I just was reading all night. So. Yeah, anyways, I got a good sleep though. And today I thought I would go hard on my makeup collection because I really want to organize my vanity. I brought up like all the makeup I had in my office downstairs. So yeah, I know, right? Like so much makeup in my office for no reason, but um, stuff just accumulates fast. So I have all this new stuff that I have to put away. Um, Bath and Body Works. 
there's some hair here. I just got some of this pixie stuff, so I thought I'd show you guys this too. Very cute little package, hair care. Um, this thing's stuffed too with stuff I got from Glossy Box. So there's like a bunch of stuff in here that I have to get out, like that body and brushes actually, but you guys already know I have my own brushes. Um, and yeah, I do have to do some brush cleaning later. I brought up baby wipes because baby wipes are my best friend when I'm cleaning makeup because usually powder and things like that, which I will show you this drawer. Oh my God. Like, look at this drawer. There's powder everywhere. Uh, so for me, I really like micro fill powders and just translucent powders. So it tends to get everywhere. Uh, loose powder, so I definitely have to clean that. But like I said, BB wipes are so easy to use and I have them everywhere, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. And then this right here, I just showed you guys this yesterday. So this is my new makeup vanity tray and I love it so much. I actually cannot wait to fill this. And then down here, I usually do this uh, if I'm organizing my makeup. So I have one bin that's going to be garbage and just like things that have expired and then one that will be like a friend's family bin. And I don't have, like I'm not like, one of those YouTubers that has like super crazy amounts of makeup. I don't buy as much as I used to. I used to definitely buy a lot for my videos, but now I'm kind of just like, I have a nice collection that I'm happy with and I don't have a crazy amount, but there are things that probably have expired. There's also things that I don't use at all. So I definitely thought this would be a fun video to watch. I know I love watching these types of videos. Uh, so yeah, and usually I'm going towards one drawer So I just want to organize everything so I know where everything is and it's just all clean and pretty for you guys. So That's what's going down today. I've got my hoodie and my comfy Sweatpants on right now because I'm doing laundry But I just thought this would be a cozy day and today's Wednesday as I'm filming this uh, But I just really wanted to do this. Also my tray is from um Nicole, so I always talk about her trays. If you guys want to check them out, I always link them in my description. And also I have my makeup case right there, which is back in stock if you guys were wondering. But yeah, you guys, let's get started. I just had to share this on Instagram, but I honestly, do you guys ever find the most random things put in the most random spots? Look at this, I found a little teacup in my Ipsy bag. And the girls do this all the time with just like random things and I'll find stuff in my purse or like, in a kitchen cabinet and it's like super random but they always do that the next thing i wanted to do is a giveaway a very quick easy giveaway of my new brush set so this is the pink ombre brush set that's going to be launching on valentine's day okay so just took out the brushes here they are they are so gorgeous i can't with these brushes uh i can't wait for you guys to see these in person they're so soft uh, so we did ombre handles and also ombre bristles with the white and pink and then of course we did the jewels all around the ferrule So I mean these are glam super super glam and I love them uh, So this is the pink ombre set that's going to be launching on Valentine's Day, but I'm going to give it to one lucky subscriber um, So I'll be announcing the winner in my next video all you guys have to do be subscribed to my channel and also follow me on Instagram and repost any one of my videos onto your Insta story to show me that you guys watch my videos. You can choose any video you want and simply just tag me. I know a lot of people already do that anyways and like I repost them all the time. I love watching you guys watch my videos, but I thought this would be a fun way to do a giveaway. Um, so that's all you guys have to do and leave some love down in the comments if you guys have entered and what you think of the new brushes that are launching. And also let me know if you guys have cleaned your makeup vanities. Have you gotten there yet this year? Ah, <sighs> I'm so excited for this. I 
I wanted to take a little break and just show you guys what I just did. So I wanted to lay out all my makeup in front of me just so I can do this all simply and easily. And sometimes if I have everything laid out that I'm like, okay, I don't need all this and it's just too much. So I tend to declutter a lot more. Um, so this pile is actually, this is all garbage. So this is expired makeup. Um, and you can definitely tell if it's expired or way too old. So look at all that. Like this is just, like even eyeshadow tends to go bad. But if you've had it for like, more than three years i would say that it's it's probably going bad and some of these are like foiled colors so uh yeah they have obviously a different kind of texture to them but you can definitely tell when stuff's gone bad this is stuff that's unopened um or just stuff that i have opened but i haven't really used um so yeah this is like a friends and family box right here a lot of nyx because nyx used to send me so much stuff and i'm not that crazy when it comes to trying out like crazy fun colors so you can see there's a lot of like purples and like artistry colors that i have in this bucket here so i'll just leave that aside you know i like my nudes so i have that and then this like i said is garbage uh, and I still have quite a bit to do this stuff over here like my lippies I definitely love my lippies and like my Too Faced and stuff So I'm keeping all that but I just want to reorganize everything because I have a lot of stuff decluttered or decluttered and get it organized But this stuff I have here too like baby wipes are my best friend when it comes to cleaning off like powder and stuff So that's what I'm also doing uh, and I'm trying to find things that are like around the same size so they can easily go in here together um but yeah, I am just taking like a little two minute break and then I am back to it. This would be like an all day thing. So I have myself an iced coffee. This is actually from yesterday. We went last night, um, but I have a little bit left, so. And I wanna show you what I've done so far. Okay, so, the, ooh, my God, I'm gonna like break things, ah, look at this. Uh, in this drawer here, I wanted to basically put like primers, um, things that I would put on my face prior to foundation plus foundation. Uh, so very different from how I had it before, but I kind of wanted to do the drawer set up as if I was doing my makeup. So like one by one kind of have things organized and um, I just love how pretty these are. So I do have these up here, but I use these highlighters and bronzers all the time. I have some stuff that I'm just putting away here. This style dry, I've never used it before. Um, shower cap, but that's much needed for my hair. So I have that. And then we're gonna fill this after I get all this Put away you know what i just figured out that i need um my palettes i need like a small acrylic organizer that can have my palette standing up that goes into my drawer i know i've seen them before so i think something like that would be really nice because the palettes won't fit into these and palettes are quite big so if i like made a palette drawer and just had them aligned up i think it'd be really nice but this one looks pretty nice this is from color pop um and yeah a lot of uh, the little primers and stuff I have in here too, like foundations, Illamasqua, these are all from my Ipsy bag, which are great. I just love trying new things uh, when it comes to skincare and like primers because, um, ooh, it's crushed a little bit on the inside. I gotta be careful opening this. Okay, so the other thing I have right here, uh, that palette was just a disaster. <laughs> there was powder everywhere, but I have all of my little powders in here. I'm a big fan of translucent powders, so I have different ones I can try out. I have like a few pixie things that aren't even open. I have my Tatcha primer, which I really like this, Silk Canvas. Um, oh my God, this is like so nice in here and so tidy. I'm so happy about this right now. Uh, ooh. And I feel, here, so you guys can see me. Bam! I'm here. Sometimes I feel like I'm hiding a little bit in organizing videos because I try to focus more so on the cleaning and organizing. Some people also say, like in my last video, like, you didn't clean anything and I'm like, or organize anything and I'm like, what? But I think because I'm talking through my video, like maybe it seems like I'm not cleaning or organizing, but I promise you I am. I'm getting a lot done. <laughs> but 
Anyways, yeah. So I also have some face masks here that I want to try out. This one here. So I'm gonna put those. These are all things I can put in my skincare drawer, which I will show you in a minute. So I have this emptied right now because I had makeup in here, but this is going to be my new skincare drawer. I have like my blackhead remover, some facial tools and stuff, cotton pads, blackhead remover, face masks. So that's where I'm gonna put these bad boys. In my upper drawer too. These are great, like for peach fuzz. I love these so much. They're just from Amazon, they're inexpensive. Holy Hannah's. This is a lot, but I'm happy I'm doing this right now. So, first drawer, this is what it looks like, and I'm so happy with how organized it is. So, just lots and lots of organizing happening today. And it's very colorful. Last time I had like little items in here that I weren't even using, but I think I'm gonna put bronzers and blushes in here because that's the second thing I tend to reach for and try the most. Uh, so. There's some highlighters in here as well, Orfra, Fenty Beauty. Uh, I love, 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 love Becca highlighters and blushes, like they're duos. These are so nice in the summer. I have so many. Look how pretty that is. I don't like her compacts. I think these are kind of ugly, but I just love the product. The product is really good. And then I have some minis of hers too. Um, these ones here, I love anything mini. Oh, this one's crushed up, Never mind. That one is a no good. There we go. There's that one. Ooh, I love this. This is so pretty. So I have those, and then I also have some pigments as well in here. So just like little pigments. So like that. Uh, and some more. I have some more. So I think this was one of her blushes. Yeah, so a little bit of a darker shade. I also have some Fenty Beauty. I really like Fenty Beauty. That's beautiful. Is that a bronzer? Shady Biz. And then Morphe, we have a highlighter. Bang Beauty right here from Ipsy, so got all those. And I think one more. So this is the last one. So I have a MAC blush. I actually use this all the time. I got this when we went up to uh, Banff, actually. And it's just such a gorgeous shade. Really natural shade that I can wear every day. And then this is also one of my favorite. I'm pretty sure this was limited edition, but this is a really nice everyday blush, fairy, or fairy flush by Tarte. I love this so much, it's so gorgeous. And then right back here, Tarte's bronzer, which I haven't really used, but I have it in here. Bam, organized. So let's go to the next two. Now I'm gonna do a little switch over here. So over here I had my lippies before, but I'm gonna put my lippies on that side and keep this side to face products, such as like Bron or bronzers, blushes, I still have this big thing that I have to organize and put in here too. Uh, and then I'll do lippies on that side. So just to switch things up a bit and just to have everything clean and organized. And then for this middle section, I really, really don't know what to do with this. I have some lashes in here, which I guess I can put my lashes in here, my Beauty Code Co. Um, I have some palettes in here, some basalt, hair ties, hair clips bunch of random things. So I definitely have to organize this too. Ooh, this is one of my favorite lipsticks. This is the uh, Patrick Ta She's Oh She's Single. It's like a nude lipstick that I love. Okay, thank God for the C. Okay. So I have this organizer here. So I'm gonna link down below all the organizers I'm using. They're from Amazon and they come in a set, I think of 20. And then this is by Algori. So this is also a different company on Amazon. Um, I like the thickness of the acrylic and um, yeah, I think it's just a really nice, aesthetically pleasing makeup organizer for either blushes, highlighters, and I always tend to wanna get more of these. So I think I might order some more, um, but I'm just going to, have these all going the right way. And I've mixed it up too. Um, since I am really downsizing on my makeup, I just have some high-end and some drugstore in here. Next thing I have here, I have smaller palettes. So um, some of my favorite ones are MAC. I have the MAC ones, Patrick Star with MAC, 
Pixie also has really nice shadows. Milani uh, Huda Beauty right here. This is also a really, really beautiful palette. Um, Pixie again. Is it Huda or Huda Beauty? Because I always get corrected on that and I'm not sure which one it is, but don't, don't hate me. <laughs> uh, okay, so I think I'm gonna put the palettes on this side. And then, ugh, ugh. Okay, we have some Hourglass, which I really like as well. Some NARS in here. Um, we have some brow products too, which is fine. It's, at least it's, it's accessible and I can grab for it really quickly. Um, palettes. Okay, so right here we have some palettes. We have this Sweet Peach. We have Milani Quads back here. We have the Natural. Okay, this is still to this day. Besides uh, the Natural Nudes palette by Too Faced, this is another one of my favorites that I use all the time. Besides my own. <laughs> Can't show it yet though, <laughs> um, but I'm I'm really excited actually to get my whole drawer of my new line once the time comes. Obviously, um, it's going to be a spring launch, but then I'll have a whole drawer like how to organize the makeup and everything like that. But this is what it looks like. I have some Bobbi Brown and then some Chanel behind that. Okay, so next container I have right here, I just wanted to quickly show you. Um, so we have some brow products, we have some mini palettes in here, uh, Natasha Denona Blush Highlight Duos Bronzer, um, and then some pixie, or pixie Blushes and Highlighters in here. And then lastly, we have some Too Faced uh, Cream products as well. So I'm just gonna have that all in here. I think there was another quad back here, or wait, no. Yeah, okay, so this looks nice. Oh, this one right here. So let's put the brow products together. Boom, that's really organized, so I have that. So the other thing I forgot is my Chanel powder. So this is something I use every single day, my translucent powder, which I have a love-hate relationship with it, honestly, because it tends to spill everywhere. Let's just make sure this fits in here. What to do with one hand? Okay, there we go. So I got it in there. So you can fit three of the medium size and then two of the large ones in one full drawer. Um, but I wanted to put my powder in here because I reach for it every day. And then I just have a few more things to put in there. But this drawer is done. Voila. Now the other thing I have, if you plan to get this set, they have little containers as well. These are the smallest ones. So they're perfect for like anything that you get in your Ipsy bag, like anything small or like small shadows um, can fit in here really nicely. So I do like to have these organized, uh, but they are going to go into my drawer here. I'll show you what this looks like in a minute. Okay, so these two are done right here. So like I showed you, those two little Ipsy containers that I have fit perfectly right in here. Uh, and then right here, I put some of my liquid uh, glitter shadows that I have here. And I have some Juicy Couture. I have some Pixie. In here, we have all my Milani blushes. These ones here. And then also my Too Faced, uh, which seem to fit really nice. So basically, palettes, eyes, and blushes all face products here, so we have blushes and highlighters, which I think this is such a nicely organized drawer now. And then on this side here, I'm gonna do my lippies now. So I'm gonna show you, I would say I probably have the most lipsticks and lip glosses, but they're all going to go on this side. My job is done, you guys. I wanted to quickly go over everything with you. Hi, Max. And yeah, mommy did a good job. So this box I have right here, this is for friends and family. So look how much stuff is in here. That's full. 
and this one is garbage. This is expired makeup, and I tried to check the smell, the dates, and just remember how long I've had stuff for. There's also some empties in here. Uh, this stuff right here, I had one more box to go through of this here. So like I said, I need to get an organizer for my palettes, my larger ones. So these are all my larger palettes that I have no room for, so I'll have to get one of those organizers, but, oh my goodness, you guys, look at this. Oh my goodness, this is Zen right here. So this is how the tray turned out. I wanted to quickly show you. Oh my goodness. It feels so nice to organize. I honestly, it's one of my favorite things to do. It's so calming and relaxing. I am obsessed with this tray. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to find some ones that look like this down below since I did get it from, uh, I got it from Not Home Sense Winners. Got it from Winners. So I wanted to quickly show you guys what I have in here. Uh, the Gizu uh, fragrance and then also hair oil. I have Too Faced powder right here. And then behind that, I have a Tom Ford highlighter duo and then Chanel. I have a Diptyque candle. I have Tom Ford Soleil Blanc, three Pat McGrath mini lipsticks, Tom Ford lipstick, uh, Kylie's toner. And then right there, I have the Venus at Floor floral flower, the mini one, and then my new brushes right there. If you guys have not entered the giveaway, make sure you to enter. Um, I explained it earlier in this video how to enter. And then right here we have the pink minis. I have some fragrances here that I wear daily. So I like to switch it up throughout the week with Way, Jo Malone, and I really like this Bella Rose one. It's nice for spring. And then right here we have the perfect spot for some of my face rollers. Behind there, Boss Babe, which honestly these brushes are just eye candy. I love the neutral tone. I have them right back there. And then some Kylie back there. So I just wanted to give you, I know people like to see like details of like what's in what and um, I thought I would quickly go over how I've organized my drawers. Now, if you guys want to see a full makeup collection video, comment down below that you'd like to see that because I'm not going to do this in this vlog or else it'll be way too long. Um, I also have right here my makeup cases. I have two, so that's in my shop. And then on this side here, not super cluttered or anything, we have some Kylie and then we also have some Chanel. Oh, I'm sweating. Okay, so for the drawers here, I actually like mixed everything up from what I had it before. So I switched this side with this side. I put all my bronzers and highlighters, blushes, face products in here, and then lip glosses on the other side. So let's show you how these look. Um, I'll just open the first two here. So we have these. Also these inserts will be linked down below. So we have like my foundations, primers, blushes, and highlighters, highlighters in here. Hi, Max. <laughs> uh, okay, we also found a dog grooming place, so we're gonna actually send Maxie there. You're gonna have a nice oatmeal back, huh? We found a nice place for you yesterday, a doggy boutique. Uh, yeah, so right in here we have palettes, and then Milani blushes, Stila, there's Pixie in there, lots of Pixie, and uh, highlighters, so. All of those, everything is so organized. I'm so happy with how this turned out. Nothing in here uh, and nothing in here. So those are for two drawers. What I think I'm gonna do is put all the palettes in there once I find an organizer for that. And then... So we have all the lippies on the top here. So how I try to do it, I try to put all my lipsticks here standing up so I can see the colors this time, which I didn't have before and it's just a little bit easier. And then I also put all the lip glosses that I tend to reach for more often. So like the Too Faced pink ones right back here. I love those prettiest packaging I've ever seen. High-end lipsticks right here, higher end. So Pat McGrath, there's some Tom Ford below that, Dior, and stuff like that. So I wanted to quickly show you guys those. And then right below that, we just have some, it's crazy how little I have in here now. Like these were filled before. Um, so I did get rid of a lot of makeup. And then right in here, we have all the little minis that I have, eyeliners and brow products and stuff. Okay, so down here we have palettes. Okay, so bigger products here. We have like Too Faced highlighters, palettes, uh, the balm. We have lots of Too Faced palettes right here, all organized bronzers, eyeliners in the back. So all organized. And like I said, two full boxes right here. Declutter is complete. Whew. 
I am so tired now, um, but this was so worth it. And I've been wanting to have a clean makeup vanity for a while now. So let me know if you guys have cleaned your makeup vanity. Also, I forgot to show you guys this. I don't have much going on in here. I just have lashes. So I think this is gonna be my like lash and applicator drawer. And this is very thin, so I don't know if I'm gonna, like there's not a lot of inserts I can find to even fit in here. So I think it's okay for now how I have it. And yeah, once I get more lashes, they will just go in there. Oh my goodness. Okay, so full little tour right here before we end this vlog, but I hope you enjoyed this. If you want to see, like I said, more vlogs on cleaning the house and organizing and decluttering, then let me know. Uh, the next thing I actually have to do is all the girls stuff. So I have to go through all their old clothes and toys and get just bins filled of stuff that we're going to be giving away and donating. So um, let me know if that's something you want to see on this channel. Ow. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so this is going to be a very quick outro. I actually have a call in three minutes with my accountant. Um, we usually do this every few months, uh, but I had so much fun organizing the makeup vanity with you guys. Like that was really, really something that I needed this January just to motivate me. And the last video that I did too, just like organizing the house, getting all the Christmas stuff down. Um, it's just, I think one step at a time. Uh, so I try to always say, focus on one area. And once you've completed it, then go to your next area. Something I used to do is I used to work on one area, move to the next and I'd like find chaos all throughout the house and like things wouldn't be done. Um, so I think definitely finishing one area first is like a must. By the way, I've started to use my planner i'm so happy i love it let me know if you want me to show more like on my stationery and stuff in my office and like what i'm using uh, but this day planner is seriously so cute i really love it so i have it out right now i'm using it uh i also bought a ton of new pens and stuff so i'm just getting my office organized i bought like a ton of books as you saw earlier i have to get all these put away as well um but yeah that's today's vlog second vlog of 2021 so i hope you enjoyed it let me know what you want to see and also enter the giveaway if you haven't all you guys have to do is repost one of my videos on my channel onto your ig stories and that's how i will know that you've entered i'll announce the winner in my next vlog um but yeah i think i'll still be doing the pantry and kitchen so i'm thinking of having that be my next vlog and have it dedicated to like the kitchen and decorating the kitchen cleaning the kitchen and the pantry the fridge and stuff like that but if there's anything else you'd like me to include let me know and i'm so sorry i haven't gotten ready like i feel like i have not been glam in so long in my videos and oh my goodness but i honestly to clean i i don't really get ready in this whole few weeks i've just been focused on cleaning and organizing decluttering and i don't really i don't know do makeup or like get my hair done for stuff like that and i'm wearing my hat because i was just like outside two seconds ago but okay i think it's been three minutes i gotta go but i hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog please subscribe if you have not joined the fam and i will see you guys in my next vlog hi boo did you guys say hi to jess you did they were talking to my accountant on on our little meeting it was so cute were you showing mini yeah were you showing your mini to jessica oh. okay let's go eat some lunch oh. one more thing i forgot to mention so i just ordered a few more things out of this collection the acrylic and gold um so i got a hole puncher and it came with like a, another little office set so once i get that i'll add it in the next vlog and these are so cute look at them Oh my god, little espresso shots, you guys. Like, so, so cute. I can't wait to use these. They make for really nice decor, but I definitely do want to use them. Um, little midday espresso. And this book here, I really, really like as well. This is a really beautiful book. So, um, yeah. Next vlog will be all about, I think, the kitchen and pantry. And that'll be my next step. 